me again. I am a beautician and I am here to beautify. I got a question. Do you maintain your hair health up under these toxic fibers that they call braid hair? I'm just saying. Or formaldehyde treated wigs. I'm just saying. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. You're not treating your hair. You got to treat it. You got to treat it with love. Okay, let me tell you how. But before I tell you how, I need to do a call to action. I need you to subscribe, like, hit the notification bell, share this. This is important. And you is important. How is it you come back to your stylist and your hair be jacked up? How is it you come back a few weeks later after having some braids or even wearing a wig, you ain't got no edges. Your ends look a mess. They dry, they frizzle, frazzle. And you just look dry like the desert. And then it's like, oh, I don't know what happened. Oh, what? You see some broke hair? I don't know what's going on. We know your head. We stand behind your head either once a week, every two weeks, or every three weeks. So we get to know your hair. Okay? I would be like, hmm. Man, your edge is looking kind of thin. Like, what's going on? I start asking questions like, did you tie your hair up? Did you use something? Are you moisturizing? Did you pull your braids back tight? So let me give you a few things that you can do to maintain the health of your hair, your edges, from, from, root, from the rooter to the tutor. From the ends to the scalp, however you want to word it. Let me give you some solutions. Okay, so for your braids, make some rice water. Spray it all the way down, like from your roots to your ends. Saturate it. You're getting your hydration and you're getting your protein. Let that set. Get out a few minutes, maybe about 15 minutes before you go to the next step. Then you get your favorite moisturizer and oil. So just do both of them. Add whatever other growth stimulating products that you use or that you may have. Make sure you use your oil last to seal in whatever moistures and whatever other strengthening products that you have. You're going to put that oil on last. Next up for your wigs. Now, however you wear your hair under your wig, that's not my business. However, you need to get some hydration up under there. Your hair is thirsty. <sighs> Add as much moisture as your hair can take. Make sure you get those edges. Please get those edges moisture. Your edges can't have too much moisture when it's covered up with this toxic wig. Now, next step is gold chai. Get ready. You're going to take that cap and spray it down with a moisturizing or oil spray. You winning. Period. You winning. Then take the gel and saturate the elastic. Your hair will love you. I promise you it will. So if you haven't been maintaining, it's not too late. This is your chance to maintain that hair health up under them toxic wigs and that toxic fiber that we put in our hair. <laughs> I'm taking this off. Cause really I hate wigs, but I just did it for the video. 
So bye for now, y'all. Love you.